Okay, so this is a, a movie about the uh, aquaponic system I made for a project, and I'm actually going to keep this design, and well, I'm going to change it up a little bit, but I'm going to keep it and use it uh, in my greenhouse. Um, and I still haven't made a video. The wind actually ripped apart my greenhouse. Uh, not the frame, just the plastic, so i got to fix it up. Uh, and I'll make a video after I fix it up. Um, basically what the system is, is a 10 gallon tank, uh, a cat box, uh, gravel, and a fountain pump. And uh, the water from the tank is pumped, sucked up through the pump, and it pumps up into the grow bed. And the gravel acts as a, uh, sort of like a biological filter. Um, and then it goes through here to my little uh, homemade kind of like a, uh, what do you call it? Like an overflow drain system. Um, the water can't pass this this bottle here. It's a bottle that's cut in half with a hose underneath it. Um, it can't go past this. Um, once it does, it flows over. And I got that piece of poly wool which acts as a filter to collect all the solids, make sure they don't go back in the tank. So it pumps it up through here into the grow bed, and then it drains back into the tank with nice clear water. It's actually working pretty well. The tank's a little dirty, but I don't care. Um, and I got an air pump here, and it pumps it into there and do aeration. I know you don't need it for a 10 gallon. I think it just makes the system look better. And I'm actually going to put a light going across here, a fluorescent light, or full spectrum lighting going across here for whatever I grow here. Just for my project for FFA. And if you don't know what that is, it's Future Farmers of America. And I believe that aquaponics is a really good way grow stuff. You grow stuff fast, you can grow twice as much, even three times more stuff in one year. Growing aquaponics. And that's what I'm doing my product on. I'm actually basing it on it's actually based on using the plants as a biofilter instead of using these uh, bacterial collectors as a biofilter for it. You're using the plants as a biofilter. And I'm going to test the ammonia and stuff like that and the nitrite and see if the system turns it into nitrates. Um, and that's that's pretty much it. Uh, it's a cool little system. I'm gonna change it up uh, with two cat boxes and a splitter, and it's uh, it's gonna be cool. It'll uh, I don't know. I think it's like you can have for like a ten gallon tank like this. You can have ten gallons of like grow bed space. Uh, I think that's what it is. I'm not sure. I'll have to check on that. But um, what I've got in there is these nice little feeder goldfish. It's the same thing I have in my aquarium. Um, and I'll do an update on that soon. Um, and yeah, they're, they're doing okay. They're a little freak out. I just put them in there a couple hours ago, but they got a thermometer in there. The temperature, I don't know, it's like like, like at 70, I think, um, without a heater. So it's doing pretty well. And uh, yeah, that's the system. All right.